everyone, it's Miguelito here, and I hope you guys are sober as I am. Uh, today it is raining, it is nuts out here. If you take a look at uh, the outside, you can see the water is come, almost coming up to my door. Uh, here it's been raining all day. But uh, even though it's raining, I'm still doing good. It's not going to dampen my day. What I wanted to talk about today was uh, using your addiction as an excuse. The reason why I bring that, I was thinking, when I started my uh, sobriety, I was smoking. I used to smoke maybe two, close to three packs a day, drink coffee like it was going out of style. And uh, for me, you know, I wasn't taking care of my health. And um, by not taking care of my health, you know, that was one of my biggest goals to reason, one of the reasons why I wanted to stop. Besides my life being unmanageable, I just wanted to stop. I wanted to get healthy. I wanted to do the right thing for myself. Uh, not getting any younger. I'm getting older. I want to uh, live my life. You know, I want to be responsible to myself and take care of myself. Well. You know, I stopped, I got arrested for the DUI, and I stopped the alcohol, and I also stopped uh, smoking. So it's been about almost 18 months since I haven't been drinking or smoking. Uh, it's a hard task, and I don't get me wrong, you know, um, I could have gotten addicted to anything, the food, you know. And for a while, I was replacing food uh, for the alcohol. When I stopped the alcohol, I said, well, okay, so it's fine. You know, I'm not drinking, I'm not smoking, I'm doing the right thing. But I was eating junk food, uh, not eating healthy, not taking care of myself. And I said, well, it's better than drinking alcohol. It's better than uh, treating myself the way I was. But in actuality, I was doing the same thing, but I was just doing it with something else. And I was doing it with food. Uh, I'm not trying to, you know, tell you to stop uh, uh, smoking, but don't use it as an excuse. And like saying, well, you know, I'm an alcoholic, I have an addictive personality, well, this is what's going to happen, but this is better than, than uh, you know, drinking. True, it's better than drinking. It's better than taking the next uh, alcohol. Uh, but until you get your, I guess, your recovery and sobriety in check and you have some time underneath your belt and you go to your meetings and understand yourself and what makes you think and your character defects, uh, take care of yourself. Take care of your health. That's one of the things. If you want to enjoy sobriety and you want to enjoy your life and you want to enjoy your uh, children, your family, and be better than what you were today, well, eat properly. You know, I'm not saying just go on a diet. Just uh, take care of your body. Uh, cut down on the smoking. If it works for you now so you don't take a drink, well, that's fine. I understand that. But, you know, you don't want to die of alcoholism, and then you're going to die of uh, smoke inhalation, uh, cancer, uh, your lungs will go bad, and it, it, it just, you know, you're just replacing one for another. So just take a look at it. For me, it's been working. I've, I've got a clearer head because when I first started with the sobriety and stopped the alcohol, I was really foggy in my head. Uh, didn't think, didn't know what I was doing. Uh, didn't remember a lot of things. And I started slowly started my head started clearing up started uh, putting positive thoughts in my mind positive things in my mind do a step at a time a little bit at a time I didn't just take a whole thing and say well I'm gonna change everything today uh, it doesn't happen that way it took a long time to become an alcoholic to become an addict it's going to take time it's not about perfection remember it's not about perfection it's about progress you gotta keep trying you make a mistake Get up, keep moving forward, keep moving in the same direction, the same goal you have. Um, it's been working. 
I hope it works for you. I hope you guys stay sober. And uh, one day at a time, you stay sober, my friend.